Are you unsure whether you should load your HTC One with the Google Play Edition software? I'm Taylor Martin, this is Pocket Now, and here are five reasons why you should. HTC, Samsung, and Google finally delivered what many have been asking for for ages, recent flagships shipping with official pure stock Android. It's something that should have been done a long time ago, as now there are some caveats to making the jump to stock Android from the custom interfaces, such as Sense5 or TouchWiz. No longer are these interfaces just skins, but deep-rooted custom builds of Android with a handful of useful features. For example, with the Galaxy S4 Google Play Edition, you don't get all the gestures, smart features, or even multi-window. And with the HTC One, you lose Zoe, the animated gallery app with highlights, and infrared. But there are plenty of good reasons to make the switch and flash the Google Play Edition software to your HTC One. First and foremost, it will be running the very latest version of Android, version 4.2.2. That means you get all the features the original HTC One was missing on 4.1. Daydream, quick settings in the notification shade, lock screen widgets, wireless display support, and access to those applications that require Android 4.2 and above. For example, we fell in love with the app called Dash Clock Widget, which serves as a daydream mode, lock screen widget, and home screen widget with a vast selection of third-party extensions for all sorts of at-a-glance information. 4.2 is exactly what the HTC One was missing out of the gate and the Google Play Edition software is the answer to just that. Further, the Google Play Edition software will be updated much more rapidly than since ever will be. Shortly after updates are announced, the updates to the Google Play HTC One will be handled and distributed by HTC. Unfortunately, if you do not have an official HTC One Google Play Edition, the updates will not come automatically. You will have to flash them manually. But that's a small price to pay for always having the latest version of Android on arguably the best piece of Android hardware available. When flashing the Google Play Edition ROM to the HTC One, you do lose several features that are specific to the One, like the UltraPixel camera software, Zoe, Blink Feed, and much more. One thing you do not lose, however, is boom sound. We were afraid the Google Play Edition HTC One would not support Beats Audio, and trust us, that would have been devastating. If you've toggled Beats Audio off on the original HTC One, you know just how big of a part the software toggle plays in the boom sound we've come to love. Fortunately, Beats Audio is still present. The icon doesn't appear in the status bar when audio is playing, but it's definitely there, tucked away in the sounds submenu in the settings app, and we couldn't be more thankful. The biggest problem with Sense is how overbearing it can be, especially for power users. It tends to stand in the way of what we want to see at every turn. The power saver notification, for example, gets in the way of auto-expanding notifications. We can't help but feel Blinkfeed would be more useful as a dedicated app or a lock screen widget than a home screen and the app drawer is cumbersome and a major waste of display real estate. Stock Android fixes all of that. It removes the Beats Audio icon in the status bar as well as the hideous NFC logo, and it gets all of the clutter out of the way. There's no bloatware, nothing forced on you, and it simply looks more clean and simple. If you've made it this far and haven't decided trying the Google Play Edition software is a lost cause and you're willing to give it a go, do it. Because you can. Because it's what we've been begging for all along. It takes just a few minutes to install and try out, and provided you make a backup of your original Sense ROM, if you decide you don't like it and it's not worth losing most of HTC's optimizations, it's just as simple to return your phone to normal. This software isn't for everyone, but it's definitely worth checking out if you find Sense to be over the top and overbearing. Click the thumbs up button below to let us know that you enjoyed the video and subscribe to see more videos like this one in the future. Be sure to follow us in all the usual places, Twitter, Google+, and Facebook at PocketNow. You can find me on Twitter at Casper Tech. I'm Taylor Martin, and I'll see you soon.